Welcome back, class is ready? back in session. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. He's ready. When he does this, we're yeah. like, we're ready to make cocktails. This. Let's do it. And, and you've got, as you are mixing up this new butterfly cocktail, yes. you, you, ha you have an opportunity to teach people how to do Cinco de Mayo the right way. I do, I do. I'm doing a, I do uh, <clears throat> public cocktail classes at a place called Danny Boy Beer Works, a great okay. brewery and distillery in the village of West Clay. Okay. I used to work there. The family, I love the owners, they're awesome. They let me use an upstairs bar that's kind of exclusive when they're not running events. So I teach classes up there publicly if anybody ever is interested. We're doing a Cinco de Mayo uh, deep dive into tequila versus mezcal. It's mm -hmm. going to be a lot of fun. So that's coming up. Nice, man. Nice. Yeah. Well, I guess we got to get back into the Butterfly Butterfly Kisses. kisses. Yeah, kind of a cool, unique name. Um, basically, we're using Butterfly Pea Flower Tea. So oh, that's okay. kind of where I came up with the name. But first, we're going to start with this gin. Aviation makes an amazing American gin. Nice. I know it looks kind of muddy. It's not the best looking. So I, I infused lavender in it. Oh. So I, I didn't know what color it was going to be, but it, it uh, is hopefully going to taste really, really nice. All so right. we got some lavender in the gin. And throw... About an ounce and a half in there. And if you guys have never had this, Hard Truth makes this amazing toasted coconut rum. They do. Yeah, I, anything they do is mm -hmm. is great. But this toasted co uh, coconut rum, rum is really nice. Rum and gin, we're off to a good start. Yeah, yes. <laughs> <laughs> right. And then we got some liqueurs we're going to throw in there. Marie Brazard, these use uh, Spanish oranges, uh, orange blossoms, and vanilla. So it's kind of a really nice high-end French triple sec. Okay. So you do a little bit there. So the liqueur is a little goes a long way. That's got a really nice yeah. blue hue. Yeah, yeah, Grapefruit liqueur, always amazing. We're going to add a little bit of sour with that and the lemon juice. And again, when I make the cocktails, it's all the about... the first ingredient that doesn't have alcohol in it. <laughs> <laughs> exactly, right down the line. You know me, I don't do anything simple. No, I mean, no. Maybe someday I'll, I'll come in and make a gin and tonic, but... Nah. Today's not one of those days. <laughs> uh, butterfly pea flower. So again, I think we talked about this earlier. It's just an amazing uh, Asian tea. It's a passion fruit tea. Really, really beautiful blue hue. Is that like the X factor in this drink? It, it? it kind of, yeah, it is. Yeah. yeah, it really is. It's really nice, sweet, very good for you. And it's some of that it's in got there. a purple hue to it. It really does. It really That's does. Stuff. Yep. And we're going to add some bitters. So the balance with the cocktail you have some of the sour, mm -hmm. uh, some of the citrus, sweet. and then you got to add the bitters, you add the sweet as well. So it's all kind of working in conjunction. A couple dashes of that. Got that. So I'm going to shake that while I grab the glass. You know? Yeah, oh, oh, go oh, for it. You beat me to it. Yes, I know. Yet, so. I know, right? Come on, George. Oh, yeah, I feel like a rock star. Tom Cruise. Cruise but there, George. Come on. Come on. There you go. Bye. Yeah, Bye. that's, yep. Hard, really hard. There you go. I always say in my, in my classes, till your hands are freezing, and they're like, come on already. And so I do it kind of be a pain. My great fear is the top will come off, and I'll throw cocktail all, all in the hair. Yeah. So, all take, in the hair. take use from Amber. She's a pro. I've yeah, made her do this yeah. many Amber's times. Nice. She's a pro. I'm still in I think we're good. for letting a dog get on the sofa, though. So. Yeah. <laughs> He's training life. Let me know <laughs> when you're ready. I think, okay. Yeah, okay. Oh, yeah. Yep, we're good. Cool. Yep. Now I give it one last. <laughs> As somebody would say, a shimmy and a shake. Shimmy shake. We're good. There you go. We'll see what this looks like. All I don't right. know why that part looks so cool to me. Just a yeah, a little <laughs> bit of flair, you know. Mixologists got to do a little bit of flair. Yeah, They're always showman. Yeah, nice little. That's a nice oh color to it. man. Yeah, what we're we gonna you do? You were concerned about the gin having that. that muddy I know. Color. That we're gonna nice. add a little bit more butterfly pea flower just right over the top there, mm -hmm. blue and purple. And let's see, we got to do spritz. I'm always about spritzes. Anyone uh -huh. knows this? So this little grapefruit spritz. What that okay. is, it's aromatics. Anytime you sip the drink, mm -hmm. you want to smell something over the top. So I do little fun things like that. And a little flower over the Show top. Some love to all the senses. Nice. Yeah, and you have butterfly kisses, a nice tropical that? spring drink. Butterfly kisses. As, as I Randall mean, takes a sip, as I we take a toss sip. it seamlessly over a Randy and Amber. Oh.